So hi everybody, it's the Butterfly Crafter, Dana Mink. So I just got back from a shopping trip. I just got a few things for the weekend, so nothing really, you know, major, just a few things. But I did stop at Harbor Freight and got a couple more boxes. So yes, so I did get a couple more because they were stocked back up. Well, I picked up one and looked at the front and the thing was broken, so I ran back and grabbed another one, and then the gentleman came along and I said, here, this one's busted. He's like, oh, okay, I'll take it. So yes, these are wonderful. There is There was one that I found, one of the uh, little tiny containers that the hinge was broke off on the back, but it's only one. I can fix it. It's no big deal. So, um, Dollar Tree, gotta set it back on the table. I did get some more gold letters because I wanted to finish up something. Sorry for the glare. And these are the ones that I needed. I had to dig for them, but I found them. And then I grabbed three of these little notebooks. Oh, they got the slop on them. This one got the little, oh, it says just chilling. And then the middle one is little kitty cats, I believe. And this is a koala bear, that's what it is. So I got those. And then I ended up finding these Cub Project Life. And I thought, oh, these are pretty good because it has the cards in the back. So that's what I like about it. So they actually are starting to get stuff in the store that some other people have hauled. Like Mommy and Kim Fairley's life. Like she hauled these. I was like, oh man, I hope these come back. So this I got for a gift. If you can see it. Okay, that's it from the Dollar Tree. Walmart. I found baby socks. It's a 10 package. And they were like $6 and something for them. But some socks. This is to finish my uh, project for somebody. I'm trying and trying to finish it, but just not working out. And another thing. If anybody finds laminating paper, it has to be the thin one. Not the thick one, but the thin sh uh, sheets. Please let me know. I will send you the money. But that, I can't find any up here. I went into Office Max. Nothing. Walmart. They didn't have any. I need the thin sheets. So like I said, they're almost like $10. So if like next month I can do it, that's fine. But for right now, I got the clear laminating um, rolls, which I don't know how this is going to work on this project. I have no clue. But I'm going to try it. If I don't like it, then I'll just wait. Then I got a box of... Uh, File folders, there are 50 to count, and there were like three something for them. Um, I got some papers, I want to start filing some things, get that all organized. So that is all for that. Food items, okay, can't forget the dog. So I got her these 12 pack, beneficial ones, she loves these. So she's going to be surprised tonight when she gets one of these because she has not had these in a while. So she loves the, she loves them all. She, she'll eat every one of them. The only food I cannot get her to eat is peanut butter. She don't like peanut butter at all. I'm not surprised because most dogs, they love peanut butter. Not her. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Then I got my bottle of uh, lemon iced tea. And this is my favorite. I'm trying to move it so you don't get the glare. Yes, I'm sitting on the floor with my tripod. Then I got a pack of uh, great tomatoes. I wanted cherry tomatoes, but these will do. These will work for now because I am gonna try and do um, a video um, maybe tomorrow. Um, make a meal. I'm gonna show you how to make something. It's called a BLT Mac Salad. And I don't know if anybody has heard of it, but it takes tomatoes, it takes cheese, 
So I got um, two cups of the eight ounce cheese, like the sharp cheddar cheese. And then I got, it takes chili sauce. And you're probably going, ew, what is that? <laughs> it takes shredded blue lettuce. And it takes your bacon, of course. So I got the great value, originally bacon. Uh, naturally hit grease smoked bacon. So I got that. Then I got the tasty cake, pecan swirls. This box will probably be gone in like a couple days. I love these things. Oh my gosh. This is my favorite. Then I got a big uh, a bag of uh, Lay's tater chip dill pickle. I love these kind. Couldn't find them in any other kind. So. Like I say, just a few things for the weekend. A uh, box of uh, Junior Mint, my favorite. Um, a bottle of syrup, so I made uh, French toast last night, and I'm like, uh-oh. Need to get some syrup. And some apple cider vinegar. Just a great value. I use that for kind of cleaning up things. And then my favorite coffee creamer, hazelnut, gotta have my coffee, that's what I use. And I got, four things of my favorite macaroni and cheese, it is Stover's, and it is uh, 12 ounce, and I love this stuff, I don't care about Kraft macaroni and cheese, this is my favorite. So I only grabbed four. So I guess I'm probably going back to the store next week. And I grabbed one, two, three, four, five, six packs of these uh, Tony's Party Pizzas. I can eat one of those by myself. These little pizzas. So that's that. Then I got a loaf of bread. Favorite bread, so that's what I use. Giant loaf, loaf of bread. And then I got a four pack of my iced tea. And that is my little grocery haul. It was heavy, but the bus driver, he was like really nice. He's like, if you don't say nothing, I'll take you all the way home. I'm like, oh God, thank you, because this stuff was heavy. So, but yep, I just made it home. It's a little, almost two o'clock in the afternoon. I left here like, um, 11.30 or so. But I'm home. I got stuff for the weekend. Not going to the yard sale. Unfortunately, my oldest daughter's got a baby shower to go to. And I was supposed to go to my daughter's, uh, or my granddaughter's, She's five years old. She's having a graduation and birthday party uh, combined, which I don't know where it's at. And I'm not going because nobody can come pick me up. So, I guess I'll miss out on that one. It is what it is. I'm hopefully maybe in the next couple years or next year I can get a car that I'm hoping for so I can be able to go and visit and do what I got to do so that I have to deal with all this. So... All right, everybody. You have a good weekend. So, like I say, maybe tomorrow night I will come on with Cook With Me, and we'll see how that goes. But it all depends on what's, what happens during the day. I don't know yet. So, we'll see. So, everybody, you have a good weekend. Bye.